Supercar Q3 for round three of the Five Nations British Rallycross Championship about to get underway. Ollie O'Donovan, Tristan Avenden, and then Mark Donnelly on the front row of the grid with Roger Thomas behind on the second row. Ready to race board is on, ready to go. Four laps, green light and blast off. Good start then from Ollie O'Donovan on the inside. Squeezed in the middle there is Tristan Avenden side by side as they come through in towards the S-Men. Avenden there with a big old dab of opposite lock. Just about manages to gather it up. And Donnelly there having to take a bit of evasive action as Roger Thomas goes joking at the start then of the first lap so it's O'Donovan that leads the way from Ovenden there very sideways indeed as they come through in towards the S-Bend and Roger Thomas there going a little bit slowly on the gravel section I wondered if for a moment he might have some mechanical dramas let's see what happens though as O'Donovan comes through to the back straight and continues leading the way behind the wheel of the number two and this is fantastic driving from Ollie O'Donovan the uh, Irishman doing a brilliant job out there on track as it stands here so far comes down in towards the S Benz then for the uh, first time to start their second lap and Ollie O'Donovan sitting second in the standings after today having taken a win in the first heat and finishing uh, fifth in the second heat uh, overall indeed I should say rather and you can see O'Donovan now coming under pressure from Tristan Avenden there as well as they flick it through in towards the uh, left-hander locking the rear wheels and problems there for Roger Thomas behind the wheel of the number 95 and he's had some dramas as he spins the car around, tries to get it facing on the straight and narrow, and he's just about able to do so. I wonder whether he might have had some mechanical problems earlier on, but I wonder if he might have had a helping hand there with uh, Mark Donnelly, because it looked like Donnelly was just recovering from that. It might have just been a coincidence that they were going through the picture at the same time, but either way, the number 95 of Roger Thomas having some serious drama then here in this uh, Q3 session for the supercast. O'Donovan goes joker, followed by the number 72 of Tristan Abenden. So the top two going through into the Joker and emerging ahead of Mark Donnelly then. Just ahead there is uh, Abenden ahead of Mark Donnelly, the reigning champion of Donnelly, of course, behind the wheel of that black Citroen DS3. O'Donovan, though, lighting up the rear tyres, coming down the back straight, 600 horsepower to the floor and heading in towards the hairpin bend of Brooklands once more we go. Locking up the rear tyres and getting it very sideways indeed there is Ollie O'Donovan. A nice show for the crowd here at Pembrey. And fantastic it is to have the crowd here at Pembrey as well. Once again, let's not forget either. Ovenden sitting there in second place with O'Donovan in third position. Roger Thomas then down in fourth place after those dramas that he had after the uh, spin or whatever it was that caused him to be facing the wrong way. But it's Ovenden that uh, leads the way quite commandingly then in this Q3 session as they come through in towards the right and then flicking it in to the left once more. Ovenden having had a fantastic time of things out there on track. Won the first qualifying session this morning in round three of uh, the Five Nations British Rallycross Championship. Didn't quite able, wasn't quite able to repeat that same feat for the second race, but uh, nonetheless, it's been very impressive so far here this weekend in Pembrey. Over the timeline we go, ready to start the final lap already here for Q3. And it's Abenden that is on the challenge with O'Donovan leading the way behind the wheel of his RX Racing Ford Fiesta. Ollie will be very happy with that going into the uh, final for round three here tomorrow at Pembrey as well. If he can continue this form, it will give him a, sur a surge of confidence going into that one as well. Mark Donnelly there trying to put the pressure onto Avenden, but not quite able to do so as it stands here. And Donnelly, we saw him being very impressive last time out at Lyndon Hill. But no such luck here for him so far at Pembrey. He's not been on the same pace as the rest of the field. And as such, his results have not been that strong compared to what he's used to. But Ollie O'Donovan comes over the line to win Q3 in the Five Nations British Rallycross Championship in the supercar class ahead of Tristan Avenden and Mark Donnelly. Roger Thomas will come home quite away down the order in fourth position. But Ollie O'Donovan then takes the chequered flag for Q3 race one for the supercars here in Pembroke.